Hey everyone, uh, been quite a few days since I put a video out, been, uh, been pretty sick. Um, but as you see, winter finally hit us, it may have not look like it, but that's uh, 12 inches of snow we've got since uh, last night it started snowing, we had none, like none. And now we've got up to about 12 inches almost on this road here on the way out. So, uh, I haven't done much. I did go out and do one, a short little check, just, a, just from the roadside. I didn't get out or anything. But today I'm gonna re rebate. Um, I'm not expecting much. I'm expecting my trail, my boxes to all be filled in with snow. And yeah, so I did, uh, I did got a little rabbit the other day here, something made it. I'll, I'll show you that right now. Well. It was back there on the other side in the fields there I seen a massive white tail. Oh it was big. Well not massive, a little smaller than when I got a couple of years ago. But it's coming up over here. I see I got a lynx or something was here. It had to have been a lynx. Half my rabbit is eaten. Or, well, it got the head off of it. Huh. I would say it would have to be a lynx. It doesn't, it looks like I must have just disturbed them here. Well, he can't have my rabbit. Alrighty, I'm gonna turn you guys off here. Well, here's what I decided to do with that rabbit. Just cause like I said, I wasn't gonna eat it, something else I already started chewing on it. So I got it in there with my a stump set, that's a 280 Belisle. So yeah, decided to put it in there, so rolling with my son, it's his 16th birthday today, so. Just rolling some trap line, checking some traps. So far, I don't think I got anything today, so I just wanted to show you what I did with that rabbit that, I, well, I just picked up. So, alrighty. Yeah, so that's that's what I that's where I got it and what I did with it. And uh, yeah, so I'm gonna try to continue on down this road. I'm probably gonna break trail all the way through, turn around and rebate on the way back. So I don't wanna be stopping and going in all this snow. I'm gonna get, I got some momentum going, so I'm gonna rally it through. Alrighty, um, I, I don't know if you guys wanted to see the rebating. It's just gonna be a bunch of snow filled traps, but I'll uh, jump out and have a look around the, the bait station there. And I'll, I'll turn you guys back on when we get to the bait station. All right, later. Well, back here, checking the rabbit snares today. Um, this is right on the other side of the road, like right there is where that one I just showed you guys got eaten. And I can see right there what it looks like a bloody foot, which means I think I got robbed again. Yep. Well, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say there's definitely a lynx in here eating my freaking rabbit. So, darn it, darn it, darn it. Anyway, they haven't been moving in here yet, and all this snow just got here last night. And like I said, that rabbit, that foot's still sitting on top of the snow. Jeepers creepers. Well, sorry, Auntie. There's no rabbit for you today. I'm gonna let this snow killer up, then I'm gonna come in here and carpet bomb this with rabbit snares. I'd like to get at least five or six. Anyway, 
We're gonna take a look at the bait station and then one more, uh, both bait stations, that's it. I drove by and did a visual. <coughs> I'm sorry. <clears throat> did a visual on the Martin sets and they're all snowed in. All eight I have set out, so. There's no catch, nothing there. I'm not gonna film any of that, so I'll just let you, I'll just have a look at the next two bait stations. Check the snares and then uh, that'll be it. Alrighty. Well, we're at the bait site and there's not a fresh coyote track to be seen anywhere. Have, well, this is just basically one I'm putting in out of curiosity. I haven't had uh, fresh bait in here in quite a while. And yeah, snares are still all set. I'll have to adjust the height on them a little bit here. Oh, there, got a snare knocked down over here. Well, actually that's pulled tight. Oh, we made a harvest. I had it set coming right through here. And, oh yeah, nothing wrong with that at all. Holy Christ, that's a fat coyote. Wow. That thing's huge. Stinks. Which means she's got a full belly gassed up. Whew. Stinks. Never had a coyote stink like that. Smells like a wolf. I just got a couple more over here. Uh, yeah, okay, I see. That one underneath there, that's still set. And this, I like, I was really hoping this one was going to connect. They got a nice little spot right through the grass there. It concealed the snare really well. But considering coyotes went down, I did set this area with 10 snares. And talked to a buyer and kind of give me an idea of what's going on. I pulled out half the snares in here just because it's a little bit out of the way just to come check but uh yes we made us a nice harvest right on second yodi of the deer alrighty I'll turn you on at the next site and get this guy in the back of the truck set the truck here and Let's just see why there was no fuss. See that? That snare is right, right behind the ears. That is a, you don't get much more of a better catch than that for your quick dispatches. I had hopes I was gonna go set another 10 Martin boxes and then I was gonna go up, up high, way up this valley, up this way, and I was gonna go set some, uh, Wolverine sets, but Where I wanted to go I know for a fact I'm not gonna get in there with all this all this fresh snow, so that, that one's gonna have to wait a day or two until we can get Plowed most of the way or I guess I can dig my snowmobile out from under the snow and Do this properly, eh? Anyway off to the next bait site Well, Here we are at the other bait site Just like last time, doesn't seem to be a track anywhere in here, but like I said, all this snow is 
fresh, so we're probably not going to see anything until we go right to each and every set. So let's, uh, oh, haven't got any fresh bait in here. I haven't been around anywhere to pick up some roadkill. I seen someone had, someone at one point had hit a deer. Uh, it was, it seemed to be a pretty big muley deer, but I couldn't lift it up. I was just too weak and too sick to do it. And, uh, whoever it was took the head anyway, so I seen that on the side of the road and it is what it is. See that snare's been pushed down and knocked to the side. Got another one down here. Somewhere down here. Oh. I see my snares. Oh no. Oh, that is very, very unfortunate. Damn it. That is a chew out. 116, 1 by 19 strand. I don't know why I didn't take them out. That's a lot of play, you know. I've Maybe it wasn't tight enough so it, it wouldn't wrap. That's that sucks. I have no idea where to even go looking for it. There's there's no fresh tracks. Like it's been four or five days since I've been out here and well that's this was fresh, so that clearly wasn't last night or in the day past day. That is unfortunate. That sucks. I, that, that's terrible to know that there's an animal out there now like that. Son of a bitch. Well, if I were to think about it, oh, this string, this string is snares knocked down and strung out. Oh, knocked to the side. But uh, I guess my only option is, I'm just going to hang that up for now. Is I'm hoping that this, this snow is going to make it hard for that coyote. I'm assuming it's a coyote. I haven't seen any other tracks in here. I'm hoping the snow makes it hard to hunt for them and it comes back in and hopefully I can get them. I'd hate to be for it to be out there too long like that. That's that sucks. But yeah, I like I said, even on this this bait site, I only I'm only running eight or nine snares. There's one snare there. Uh, that snare's been knocked down. I'm assuming it's just snow. Yeah. I'm going to hang that one up for now too. Because it's just going to keep snowing. I'll, uh, I'll reset these again once the snow stops. And hopefully they can get some more, some more sign in here. See that one's pretty low. Uh, right there. I have to adjust that for the snow level. I can do that one right now and I'll just walk this trail right through it. There. I didn't take nothing. There. That looks pretty good. Well, no catches on this bait site today. Oh, look, I almost missed that one. That one's been knocked down too. So, if they're knocked down, I'm just gonna put them up, close the loop a bit, put them up so they don't get disturbed. If they're still standing, I'll adjust them. I think it's just, uh, 
I think it's the snow, not not actual animals knocking them down. So, because like I said, there's absolutely no sign in here. Anyway, that's the that's the day's events. One one yodi went one eating up rabbit, second eating up rabbit. Well, alrighty. Hope you all enjoyed the video.